Okay? So let us look at the 2019 paper 2 GC question of matrices. Uh, it's saying uh, the determinant of matrix Q, which is this matrix, right? So matrix Q has these entries of what are positive, uh, positive 8, positive 12, X minus 4, and X. These are the entries of matrix Q. Now the determinant of this matrix is what? Is 8. Take note you have been given it's what? It's 8. Okay? Then I've been told to find, Roman numeral 1, they want us to find the value of x. They want us to find the value of who? x, this variable. Okay? So in this case, how do you find the value of x? Now since you have been given the determinant of this matrix, okay, you're going to apply the formula of finding what? Determinant. Okay? So, solutions. Uh, Roman numeral 1. They want us to find the value of x for which the determinant of matrix Q is what? 8. So we know that uh, Q determinant is equal to now how to find the determinant of this matrix. We know that the determinant of a matrix is uh, found by finding the product of the major diagonal. This is our major diagonal. Take note. This is our major, major diagonal. And this is our what? This is our minor diagonal. Okay, this is our minor diagonal. So first we need to find the product of this major diagonal. Then we subtract the product of the minor diagonal. So in this case, what is our major diagonal? We have been given is what? 8 multiplied by what? By x. Okay? Then minus the product of the minor diagonal. This is our minor diagonal. So we are multiplying 12 uh, multiplied by what? x minus minus 4 okay so in this case since you have been given take note the q determinant the determinant of q have been given is what it's 8 so where there is a determinant of q you put 8 you're going to put 8 here okay so it's a 8 is equal to you can now multiply 8 times x you get what 8x okay then minus open up the brackets in this case you say uh, now we multiply this 12. We multiply 12 by these two tens. So 12 times x you get 12 x. Okay? Then uh, this 12 has got a positive. Positive times negative is negative. Then 12 times uh, 4 you get what? 48. 40, 48. Okay? Then you maintain 8, which is our determinant, is equal to 8 x. Okay? Then just multiply in this case. You just multiply, you say, uh, negative times uh, positive, it's what? Negative. 12x. Then negative times negative is what? Positive. Then uh, 40, 48. Okay? So it's like you have got a 1 here. So I'm saying uh, negative 1 times 12x is negative 12x. Then negative 1 times negative 48, you get positive 48. Okay? So in this case, we say 8, you maintain our determinant 8 is equal to, now, you can subtract these, these are like them. So you can say 8, 8, x minus 12, x, you get what? Negative what? Negative 4, x plus 40, 48. Uh, are we moving together? Yes. So in this case, uh, what you do is you can now correct like things. You can now correct like things by saying, if you transpose this negative, negative uh, 4x on this other side, you're going to have positive what? Positive uh, 4x is equal to your good 48. This side, when transpose this post, this one is positive this side. When transpose, when it becomes what? Negative or minus 8. Okay, then just say 4x is equal to 48 minus 8, you get what? You get 40. Then for us to remain with x, divide both sides by the coefficient of x, which is 4. So over 4 this side. Over 4 this side. 4 into 4 is 1. 1 times x, you get x is equal to 4 into 40. You get what? You get 10. This is our value of what? x. So x is equal to what? Uh, 10. Now, Roman numeral 2 is saying uh, find the inverse of matrix Q. They want the inverse of this matrix, matrix C, matrix Q. So first and foremost, we need to have the actual matrix of Q. 
Okay, act matrix of Q. This you have been doing it's 8, then 12, x minus 4, then x. So since we know this is not the actual a matrix, we need to substitute what is x, you put what? You put 10. Okay? So our Q is equal to 8. What is our x then? x minus 4, then you have 12, take notes. What is our x? It's 10. Okay? So our Q finally is what? 8, 10 minus 4 is 6, then you have 12, and finally what? 10. So these are the entries the of what? Matrix Q. So I'm going to use this matrix Q, the actual matrix Q, to find its what? Its inverse. So how to find the inverse of a matrix? So it's the uh, Q inverse is our normal numeral 2. Q inverse is equal to 1 over the determinant of matrix Q multiplied by the adjoint. Adjoint of what? Adjoint of matrix what? Matrix Q. Okay. So it's, a, uh, it's equal to let us just find our, ad, our adjoint of this matrix. We have a determinant. We're going to say 1 over, what is the determinant of matrix? So you have been given a note. The determinant is 8. So what is the determinant of Q? Just put 8. Okay, now what is our adjoint? Let us find the adjoint of this matrix. Okay, so since this is our matrix, what? This is our matrix, see? Our Q. How do you find the adjoint of this matrix? Take note, I said uh, the entries in the major diagonal, they switch positions. So this 10 is going to go where 8 is, and 8 is going to go where 10 is, okay? So we are going to have 10 here, then 8 here, okay? Then what happens in the minor diagonal? These, they change the signs. So since this one it is uh, positive 6, it's going to become a negative what? Negative 6. And this is positive 12, it's going to become what? Negative what? 12. This is our answer. Or if you want to can even ex uh, multiply this scalar by what is inside, you say that is all. You can say one one over eight times ten you get ten over what? Ten over eight. Then one over eight times four you get what? Negative twelve over what? Over eight. Then one over eight times six you get negative what negative six over over eight one over eight times eight you get uh, what eight over what? eight over eight sorry eight over eight okay so you can leave your answer at this level you can even reduce this where possible so which number can you go into common factor that is common factor is two two into ten is what it's five then two into eight is four okay then uh, 2 into uh, negative 12, you get what? Negative 6 over 2 into 8, it's what? It's 4. Then 2 into negative 6, you get what? Negative 3 over 2 into 8, you get what? You get 4. Then 8 into 8, it's what? It's 1, just 1. As you want to so this is our answer. So this one, this one, or this one, there is no problem, okay? That's the way you answer. Since. <laughs> Sí, se va a hacer.